Hi, I'm Harold Enger from Spring Green and I'm here to talk to you about St. Augustine grass. That's the type of grass growing in this lawn. It's a very common warm season grass. A lot of people like it because it's more shade tolerant than centipede or Bermuda grass. And as you can see here, this is a somewhat shady lawn and it has a really nice color. Caring for your St. Augustine grass requires you to mow it at a higher height, two and a half to three inches. You also want to keep it watered because it does uh, get drought stress during the summertime. And it needs a moderate amount of fertilizer. So you want to keep it fertilized to make it look nice and green. It's not going to have that deep dark green that some people are looking for in, let's say, a zoysia lawn, but it's going to have a nice attractive green color. And I think overall, you're going to like it, especially if you have a more of a shady lawn. Some of the major problems that can occur with St. Augustine grass, first of all, there's an insect called a chinch bug that will feed on it and cause some damage. Uh, there are two diseases that will affect it. One is called gray leaf spot. You need to check for that in the late summer. And the other one is St. Augustine decline, which shows up uh, a lot of times over the winter time in the spring when the grass, you're hoping it to green up and it just doesn't come back. So you need to be aware of those and make sure that you're checking for those on a regular basis. That's why we encourage you to contact a professional lawn care company like Spring Green so that they can come out there and maintain your lawn, check for the diseases, because you would hate to have your lawn get destroyed by these problems. To learn more about St. Augustine grass and how to take care of it, contact your neighborhood lawn care professional at Spring Green. Or you can visit us on our website at www.spring-green.com and click on the Ask the Expert blog where you can learn more information about lawn and landscape problems and send me a question. I'll be happy to respond to you. Thank you.